Hello, fellow Binanceans. Oh, God, I'm having a bad hair day. <laughs> Who cares? Um, okay, so it's Sunday morning or Sunday afternoon. And I thought I'd make a, a video about um, George from Cryptos R Us. Now, George from Cryptos R Us, he's a good YouTuber. And he's, I think he's one of the first YouTubers that I uh, started watching. And um, he's a good guy. But... The question I'm going to ask today is, has he sold out? Okay, so has he sold out? So I want to watch, play some of um, this video that he did last night for about Cadena, um, Cadena, Cadena. Um, and it's about one of his sponsors. So let's just play it and let's just talk about some of the things he, he says in it. For tonight, and that is Pink Finance. Pink Panda Finance. Uh, they label themselves as the future of finance. They are going to be an all-in-one wallet and DEX that's on top of the Binance Smart Chain, but it's going to be a pure mobile play on Apple iOS and, of course... So, <laughs> to say, like, to advertise a product that's going to be Pink Panda, the future of finance. I mean, I find that a little bit hard to swallow, first of all. It doesn't sound like the future of finance, I've got to say. But let's just go on some of the things that George says about various coins. That he, he, so if you don't know about George, some of the things he... What he does is he, he discusses a topic, topic first, and at the end, he always has a question and answer session that can last about 20 minutes, although I think he's started to cut it down recently. And normally what he does, he, he slates various coins. So he basically looks at a coin and says, oh, no, it's got this. That's it. I'm not bothering looking at it. So the first thing that I can see about this pink panda is this number of zeros. Look at it. I mean, I, I'm going to lose count. There are a lot of zeros in this pink panda coin value. Okay. So it just screams of like being a meme coin straight away kind of thing. So... You know, normally he would get this kind of coin and people say, go and have a look at this coin, George. And then he'd see that and just instantly turn off. But here he is, he's advertising it because he's getting moolah, okay? He's getting paid. So has he sold out? Okay, so let's carry on. Uh, Google Play, right? So what they want to do, why it's different than all the other finance plays, DEX plays, is because they want to make it really, really easy for anyone to get into um, coins that are listed on DEXs. Because right now, centralized exchanges, centralized apps are the ones that get all the attention. They're just really easy to use. And as simple as Uniswap or SushiSwap or EnergySwap is, there's still a learning curve and Pink Panda wants to get rid of that and they want to make it as easy as possible for anyone to basically download the app and track all their tokens and be able to trade on the DEX very, very easily. So according to them, they're going to be concentrating on community first. They have a token with real value. They are going to be obsessing over design and UX. We will see if that is true. Uh, friendliness, DeFi, OnRamp. And charities in their DNA. In fact, they made three charities or uh, three charity donations ready. Okay, there you go. So charity donations and stuff. So this is another thing that George always pull, that George always pulls up on. So as soon as a client mentions that they're charity, okay, he basically has a go at them. You know, you know, he just says, well, you know, if they're charity, why don't they just give it to charity anyway? Why do they have to kind of do all of this? Okay, so. He, he hates charity coins, you know, like save the whale, save the panda. You know, here we've got pink panda. Um, you know, save the pandas in China. All of these things. He, he hates those coins. But here he is advertising it now. You know, a charity coin. So that's two. Pretty nice. Compliance ethics and positive vibes. Okay. Here's their token economics. They released one quadrillion token. One quadrillion, that is a hell of a lot of tokens. Okay, so that's another thing. But 50% of it was burned, 5% goes to dev. Okay, <laughs> another thing, 50% burned on launch. <laughs> Why, what's the point of that? Okay, burn as you go, but 50% burnt on launch. That's just like, uh, <laughs> it just makes no sense. 
I can't believe he's, he's shilling this coin. I really can't. I think it's bad. What do you think? Five uh, percent for charity and marketing, which they have. Have. There you go. Charity and marketing again. Done already, and ten percent transaction tax to liquidity pool, and five percent to all. There you go. A transaction tax for. So basically, when you're buying the thing, you get a transaction tax. It's, it's another one of these things, like a like a safe moon thing, where you get fees for buying. It just it just feels like all of that. Okay, and if we kind of go back, okay, uh, blah, 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 here, if you read some of this, so community first, so obviously that screams of meme coin, it screams like Doge coin, that kind of thing. Two, a token real utility. So let's read this real utility. Many tokens claim utility, often in distant roadmaps. We have delivered utilities since day one by rapidly rolling out our version one mobile app so they've got a mobile app okay and following up with weekly updates okay i just <laughs> where's the utility in that it's got nothing to do with banking or anything like that it's got, you know it's nothing you know so i i feel like he's i feel like he's just sold out here how much we've been paid here george for this that's what I want to know. How much are you being paid? So, do you think he uh, sold out? That is my question. Do you think he sold out? By the way, I still think George is a great YouTuber. I'm still going to subscribe to him. I'm still going to watch him. But I think he made a mistake on this video, on on this uh, on this sponsorship deal. Okay, so I, I, you know, I think the Mueller got to him this is a project he would stay clear of in a million years, I think, normally. So what do you think?